By default, you are getting static wallpapers in Windows 10. But have you ever wondered that these are kind of boring sometimes and you would like to lay your hands on lively wallpapers? There is an app in the Microsoft Store named as Lively Wallpaper that sets live wallpapers as the desktop background. Just check this out. With a few couple of steps, you get a system as beautiful as this one. Even it can interact with the mouse so that when you move your mouse, it shows the animations accordingly. Also, there are several other parallax wallpapers that are there. For example, this one, which follows your movement of the mouse and shows the location of the clouds and the sea accordingly. Other such wallpapers are also there like Eternal Light, Periodic Table and more. Now when the desktop wallpaper is already done, now let us talk about the taskbar. There is an awesome small application in the Microsoft Store that is the Translucent TB which can be used for designing and redesigning your taskbar also. Now there is another app that is the Taskbar X but since it does not work out correctly for me, I'm not going to mention it in this video. So let us start Translucent TB. After accepting the GPL version 3 license, we find that the taskbar becomes transparent. Going here, right clicking on the translucent TB icon, we click on regular and change it to fluent. When we change it to fluent, we find this beautiful fluent design. Now, sometimes fluent taskbar does not work out properly and you will be able to see some glitches. In such a case, if you like blur as much as I do like it, you can change the regular to blur. Now this is just a lower version of the blur that is the one present in Windows 7 that is the aero blur that we get. We don't get to see such glitches appearing in this one. Now similarly you can change the others options like when the start menu is opened you'll be able to see that the normal taskbar version is being displayed over here. So you can change each and every part in the way you did like to. Sometimes opening files and searching through them can be difficult. Opening every file and viewing them is also very difficult. So how about getting an insight on the files that you're searching for? Well, there is also an app for this that is the quick look from the Microsoft Store. So just head over to the Microsoft Store, search for quick look and download it. And now after you've downloaded it, you don't need to do anything. It will just start working on its own. So whenever you head over to a file and click on the file and press the spacebar button, it opens up the file and show you. By default, this is basically the recording that I'm doing now. And you can see that it shows the recording in a small window and opens it up, which can be easily closed by pressing the cross button. The same goes for any other folder, small informations that do matter. Now, how many times have you thought that, like in Linux, when you connect your phone to the computer, magically the audio starts playing in your computer also? So if you're someone who would like to experience the same thing on Windows, well, there is also an app in the Microsoft Store that is the Bluetooth audio receiver. So just by opening the Bluetooth audio receiver, you will be shown the devices to which it can be connected and paired with. After pairing your device, you can just simply click on the device and then click on open connection and it will connect automatically if your Bluetooth in the phone is on. And now after that, you can play all the music that you want from your phone and it will play directly from your laptop speakers. Now if you have a local area connection or a local area network that is LAN, in your house then sharing things over PCs becomes very simple with an app named Ducto for sharing all the files that you need. Download Ducto from Microsoft Store and then open it up and then open Ducto in your phone or in the other laptop where you want to share the file and then just drag and drop and the sharing will continue smoothly. Just a reminder that your devices should be connected to the same router or over the same local area network. Copying, cutting and pasting text becomes much easier with a simple application in Windows 10 that is Panther Bar. When you install Panther Bar from Microsoft Store and then head over to do some research work. For example, let us search for the planet Venus. And if we head over to the Wikipedia page and select some information from the page instantly the panther bar shows up to show all the possible actions that can be taken like copy cut 
paste search and also share it with windows now when you click on share this option opens up from where you can share it over nearby share docto if you have it installed in your computer as i have shown it today if you don't know the meaning of some word while doing a research work then you can easily even select that word and panther bar will show up and click on search searching the google will show up information about that planet or the word that you have selected so it becomes very handy when you are doing some kind of research work we sometimes do a lot of work on notepad on general notepad if we open it up we find that it is the white background and it is not quite consistent with the system dark user interface if you like to use the dark theme a lot then you won't probably like the light interface of notepad there is an app in the microsoft store that is the black notepad if you install this app and open it up it has the same interface as notepad just it is the black version with the white foreground colors so if you just type over here it shows up on the black background which looks far more consistent with the user interface and is also much more soothing to the eyes now you might think that the interface in windows 10 is quite old in certain places for example the flyouts for the volume and the brightness are taken directly from windows 8 so why not just change it with something more modern and consistent with the user interface modern flyouts can change the old looking flyouts into something as interesting as this one that quite well goes with the current system it also has several other options for example turning on and off the caps lock button also shows the flyouts and also the number lock button shows the same thing so for getting modern flyouts it is the same place from the microsoft store you can go and just download and then opening modern flyouts will give you all these options to change even in personalization you can change the flyout theme and appearance to light and dark also Tell me how many times you have felt that it is not very much economical to have so many applications running in your computer. There is an application in the Microsoft Store named as the File Viewer Plus. This allows you basically to open more than 150 file formats starting from zip files to PDFs and it even lets you edit Word documents. And not just word documents, also videos.